Alright, welcome back to Let's Play the Spongebob Squarepants Movie. We're going to a uh, bubble blowing baby hut. Where all the thug, where all the thieves and thugs like to raise their mugs. So yeah, I uh, skipped the rest of the cutscene to this level to save time. Because either no cutscene or no video. But, uh, there would be a cutscene where, um, the, one of those guys with, the, with those worm dogs was carrying the key to the paddy wagon, Spongebob will go to get it, and those, and those guys spin around and knock him away, showing how they work. And to defeat them, you have to simply ground pound them. But those, got, but those thugs with the dogs are forced to be reckoned with, I'll tell you that much. So yay, the Thug Tug. One of the many scary places on the way to Shelf City. And we're close to another level up, booyah. So, um, anyway... Um... Today, Cartoon Network is having a marathon of action shows. And it'll be going on for the rest of this three-day weekend. And Teen Titans will be coming on at three o'clock, from three o'clock to five. So be sure to watch it if you're a Titans fan. <laughs> That's a good way to get some points. Holy shit, that was a lot of points! Alright, now we're going to meet up with another new enemy. Yeah, we're having two enemies in one stage. That's very rare. That's about the, that's about all of them regarding the key. <laughs> yes. Enemies that come out of their little shell thingies and and shoot at you. And if you get too close, they're going to open up. And all you have to do is simply walk up and destroy them. They're kind of easy to avoid, but that only depends on what sort of area you're in. See how we are able to ground pound? Simply push the B button. Well... Or as, or maybe, um, well, I call it ground pound, but some of you might call it, some of y'all might call it the eh, smash. I like to know what the eh stands for, but oh well. Do you ever recall there being a secret treasure down here? Oh well. Uh huh. I sh want me to explain why I strongly disagree with you, Patrick? Oh, well, what's down here? Big fat ass points, baby. So, yeah, the red barrels are, you know, powder kegs. They do serious damage, and they give you points. Lots and lots of points. <laughs> they also have a, a wide range of attack. Ah, uh, here's a little fun section where you gotta keep hopping on these platforms hitting the switches. You gotta hurry before the platforms sink into the water, in which you cannot swim in this game because SpongeBob and Patrick are retards.
Hey, wait a minute. I have a level up, don't I? Now I got the super ground pound. Yeah, we're able to make a little shockwave now. I think it's able to stun enemies, from what I, from what I remember. Try out that cartwheel. Never really try out the super cartwheel, did I? Pretty nice move. Alright, now we're gonna go down here. Now this is, um, uh, a whole nother mission in this little section. It's called the Disco Star. And I've always liked it. Now, watch what happens when you hit this switch. It turns into a disco room! In the background, there are thugs watching you dance. The gimmick for this mission is... Touch those red squares and you'll take damage. That's the gimmick. And there are some thugs up there dancing to the music. I've always really liked this mission. Also, take your time to get some points if you should wish. And you should indeed wish. It's a little... Each little platform has a sort of pattern for how the glowing squares go. But hey, the music changes, that's pretty cool. That's what I really like, is the music changes for the stage. Well, for this little section anyway. Freaks. Now we're back in this little section. We can jump down here and fight some enemies. And we're about to get ourselves another level up. Defeating defeating the enemies in this room as well as the the room back there would have broken that barrel. That barrel would uncover a secret treasure, yes? And I like that little chain reaction part. Pretty fun to watch. And hey, I have another level up, don't I? We're gonna, um, power up our health now. Now Patrick has four Krabby Patties. I mean, four HP. And here is the boiler room. I had no idea what you were just said there, Patrick, but oh well. This game really needs subtitles. Well, it does have some subtitles, but you know. Guess next door needs subtitles too. Oh yeah, for now I can remember that secret treasure that just uncovered in... in, um... One of the later rooms, we won't be able to get because, as you can see, there's a mini game right there. And entering that mini game will force us to have to kill those enemies again to um, open up that, to uncover that secret treasure. And that's kind of bad programming how that whole thing works. See, so, yeah, um, we're doing another combat arena next time.